Hi, this is Brad Yeager with your weekly grain market update for the market week ending Friday, June 24th. On the week, corn futures were down 34 cents in July and down 57 cents in December. Nearby soybeans were down 91 cents, while new crop bean futures were down $1.13. And finally, wheat futures were down $1.10 this week. Markets had a shortened trading week as the markets were closed Monday with the new federal holiday. After putting some weather premium in the markets last week, markets dropped this week as the extended forecast backed off on the hot, dry conditions predicted earlier. Weaker stock market and global markets also pressured grain prices as the fear of a recession seems to be increasing. Export prices in South America have also dropped recently, causing the U.S. to start missing out on export business again. Crop, crop ratings this week had the nation's corn crop rated at 70% of the crop, either good or excellent, which was down 2 percentage points from the week prior. Soybeans were rated 68% good to excellent, which was also down 2 points from last week. Winter wheat ratings dropped 1 percentage point to 30% of the crop good to excellent. We now look ahead to the big quarterly stocks and acreage report next week, Thursday, June 30th at 11 a.m. The USDA will update their estimates for stocks and, most importantly, planted acres. This is usually pegged as the biggest report of the year and often can have some fireworks and big price moves. With the drop in prices, don't be too quick to give up on contracting bushels. Recommend calculating what you have for expenses and try to protect the profit. And of course, give us a call with any questions. Thank you for listening to this week's Market Recap from Country Visions.